Hi, this is a quick three minute video on this. Hi, this is the third video in the series where we're looking at uh, five popular questions. It's part two on the uh, playlist. Please do stop the video. Have a go at each of these questions. These are predicted questions for this year's GCSE. In the previous two videos, we completed through to the end of question two. In this video, we're going to look at question number three onwards. OK, so here we are at question number three. This is one where we're looking to rationalise the denominator. What we basically mean by that is make the denominator a whole number. OK, and the way we're going to do that is if we look at the denominator first, I've got 9 minus root 6. Now, the problem I've got there is I've got that third root 6 to deal with. But if I multiply it by 9 plus root 6. It has the effect of cancelling out. You'll see what I mean in a minute. However, I've also got to multiply the top numerator by the same number. So I'm left with this situation where I need to just now expand that through. OK, so the top half of it mm, is a little bit hard work. You've got 18 multiplied by 9, which is going to be 162. And then I've got 18 times root 6. Well, that's easy enough at plus 18 root 6. And then I've got 9 multiplied by minus root 6 is minus 9 root 6. And then finally, I've got minus times a plus is going to be a minus, And it's the square root of 36 because 6 times 6 is 36. Now, I know that's going to be... 6. OK, so that deals with the numerator. And by the way, I'm very aware that you might do your multiplication slightly differently to me, but this is the way that I would do it on this video. OK, so let's look at the uh, denominator. A um, little bit easier. I've got 9 times 9, which is going to be 81. And then I've got plus 9 root 6 minus 9 root 6. So basically those two will cancel themselves out. And then as before, I've got uh, a minus times a positive, And that's going to give me negative root 36, which again we've said is 6. And then really it's just a case of tidying this up a little bit more. So what I'm going to end up with at the top, the um, numerator is 162. And then that's going to be basically minus 6. So 162 minus 6 is going to give me 156. And then I've got uh, plus 18 root 6 minus 9 root 6. Well, that's going to give me 9 root 6. And that's all divided by 81. And don't forget, those two numbers cancel themselves out. And I've got 81 minus 6, which is going to be 75. OK, now... Um, for that particular answer, you would get probably two marks. It depends on the mark scheme. Um, the thing to do is to recognize that 156, 9 and 75 can all be divided by 3. So as a final answer to get that full three marks, you might end up with 52 plus 3 root 6 all divided by 25. Now, I do appreciate it's not particularly much different to the actual original original question, but that is rationalising the denominator for you, making the uh, new, uh, the denominator whole number. I hope it's been useful. If you're not sure about any of these, please do let me know in the comments. And I do have the playlists and videos that I can point you towards. And I look forward to seeing you inside the next video. OK, so I hope the video was useful. Please do add a comment below if you're not sure about anything. I'll always come back to you. Subscribe to the channel. I look forward to seeing you inside the next video.